Hey, it's Daisy, and we'll be doing elephant nails today. Um, so as always, just start with the base coat, any base coat you like, and we'll just get started on the elephant's face. So I'm using Bamboozled by Ulta. It's like a really light blue. And this design is going to take up three nails to do the elephant face. One for the face, one for the main face, and two for the ears. So what you could do is on your index finger, on your middle finger, and on your ring finger, you can do the elephant face while your thumb and your pinky can just be painted all blue with this light blue color. So we'll start with the middle uh, nail to do the elephant face. So you're kind of going to do an oval with a flat top just to get like the main um, face ready but make sure you leave a little bit of uh, space on the side. Um, we're also going to do the nose so just kind of drag it down and kind of curve it towards the bottom just to kind of look like if the um, nose, the trunk, is hanging down a little bit. Um, so on the little bit of side that you left next to the face, you're actually going to draw the beginning part of the ears. Um, it's just going to help con like connect the whole image together. And then on your other two nails, you'll see that I'm doing the basic shape of what like an ear, like what the um, elephant ear should look like. So just kind of like a rounded square that gets thicker as you get farther away from the elephant's head. And then this is a really light color so just go over it, over it with a few coats so you can get a nice deep blue. And with all my nails most of the time they're left uh, blank in the back but you could always use like a natural looking um, nail color under like a skin color one. Um, and then with a black liner, I'm using the Kisses black liner and I'm fast forwarding all this because it took me about four minutes to outline the whole elephant. Just outline the elephant, um, the ears, the, he the head, everything. Just to kind of bring out the design a little bit more. And this is kind of tricky so just work with it and be patient do thin lines like I said it took me a long time to be to do this so that's why I had to fast forward all of it and then you see when I'm outlining the trunk I'm not really going from the tip of the trunk I'm kind of bringing it up towards the inside of the face so it actually looks like it's part of the like the face like it's coming from the uh, from the inside of the face not just coming under like the chin and then I'm also going to add a little bit of hair to the elephant's head. So you'll see me add like three little hair lines on the top. Just makes it a little cute. And then after that I'm adding a few lines to the elephant trunk to just kind of give it like little wrinkles. So use whatever white you have. I'm using Snowy White by Sim Simple Colors. And then do two big, two big dots for the elephant eyes. And once you're done with that, let's go on and fill in the ears. So I'm using the color Airhead by Ulta, which is just also light pink. And we're just going to use that to fill in the inside of the elephant ears. This is also really light color, so it might take a few coats to get a good pink. And also you're painting on top of a darker color. So After that, just get uh, any blank uh, black color and use a dotting tool and fill in the eyes for the elephant and you're already done with your elephant. So I hope you guys enjoyed this. This is the last animal in my animal themed <laughs> nail tutorials. Um, so I hope you enjoyed it and keep watching. Thanks and please subscribe.